Measles is largely an eradicated disease in America, but it's been making headlines after an infected person's trip to Disneyland leads to the virus slowly spreading across the country. I talked to Dr. Steve Osborne from Doctors Express in Roanoke with more on what you should know. Measles is a viral infection uh, that we don't really see much anymore because of immunizations that started back in the 60s and 70s. After it's been around a while, people kind of take it for granted. You know, we don't see it anymore. Therefore, it's easy for people to stop getting immunized, and then all of a sudden, you can pop back up again. Its reappearance, even on a small scale, has the CDC concerned because it's one of the most infectious diseases on record. And you get it from just exposure, from, um, from being around people that have congestion or cough that have the measles. The disease is contagious for several days before symptoms show. If you're not immunized and you come across an infected person, your odds of catching measles is 90 percent. Initial symptoms would be just like a common cold or cough so you may not know you have it you could just be getting congested coughing fevers common um, conjunctivitis is common you can get redness in the eyes the rash typically is going to start about three or four days like I say after those congestion and cough starts red rash maybe slightly raised usually starts on the face goes down. For most people, a cough and a rash are all they really have to worry about if they contract the disease. But for babies, the elderly, pregnant women, and those with compromised immune systems like cancer patients, measles can carry serious complications. For this reason, some doctors' offices in other areas of the country have chosen not to accept patients who haven't been vaccinated. I think if you were in an area, like maybe in areas like in California where they've started to see several cases, that might be more of an issue. Fortunately, we've not seen it in Virginia and it's not been an issue. Therefore, I don't think that's something we would worry about here. But I think the whole concept is, is obviously if you have people that aren't uh, immunized, they potentially could have measles and be in that early phase where they don't have symptoms yet and be contagious. While he understands there are other schools of thought, Dr. Osborne recommends everyone be vaccinated against the measles. You know, they've never been able to prove there's any major problems from the immunizations. I know there's been question on that, um, even with autism and immunizations, but they've never been able to prove any of that. Um, you know, and just based for just safety of the population as a whole, you know, it's the wise thing to do. And thank you, Dr. Osborne from Doctors Express for that expert advice. Doctors Express is located in the lower level of the Tower Shopping Center in Roanoke. No appointment is, is, ne is necessary. Walk-ins are welcome. For more info, call 540-774-0000 or you can visit DoctorsExpressRoanoke.com.